All right. So, um, tier list. We've got it here. Uh, let me get it a little bit bigger for some of y'all. There you go. Um, ah, yes. That even puts the, the chat right in the corner. Perfect. Amorous. Somehow this all works out. Um, <laughs> caboose. I know, right? But it's going to be that way. We're going to, we're all going to be a little twitchy, uh, a little twitchy for a while. Dude, Caboose, I'm not kidding you. When you said that, I looked down at my status bar on OBS and the, uh, the, the, the green, um, so in OBS, you have a green, yellow, and red indicator. I've only seen it go red twice in all of streaming. One time when level three was having outages and then the night of, right? So now we're doing simultaneous recording and streaming. I glance down as you say that, and I see the red of the recording light. And I almost had a little mini heart attack myself as well. I was right there with you, Caboose. And then I glanced over and saw the green of the actual indicator. And I was like, oh, fuck it, eh? And that's, we're all caught up. Um, oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, all right, so. Uh. Uh, because he was an emperor. Uh, okay. So Alice, hi, my name's Kai. What's it? Sorry. Sorry. We will get to it. Alice. Hi, my name's Kai. Uh, generally speaking, the, uh, longtime members and myself of this community are various flavors of anarchist. Um, we're, I am a dyed in the wool anarchist and have been for many, many years. An emperor is just a dictator in other names for us. It's an authoritarian and that's, they're in the pile. So, you know. Um, so yeah, em dictators and revolutionaries, dictators and revolutionaries. Um, and, um, Amorous made this list. I did not create it. Um, so if you have questions, you're going to have to direct them at Amorous and I would probably, you know, advise you to not direct too many questions at Amorous because it's just, why didn't you put this or why didn't you, come on, they're either there or they're not. Uh, Amorous was uh, ever so kind uh, enough to uh, put time in creating this beautiful list. I'm going to use the standard completely ableist objectionist uh, objection scale uh, of ones and tens that we're all familiar with um, that Western society has been uh, reducing and reducting and paternalizing um, various members of our society with since ever so long ago, I'm sure. Um, also, uh, let's see, we're go I'm going to know most of these, but I, there's, I'm sure there's gonna be a few that are gonna slip me up. Um, this Steven Seagal looking motherfucker is making me work. Um, okay, so let's start at the top um, and just get the hotties out of the way as far as I'm concerned. Um, fuck, this is, this is not that difficult of a choice for me, frankly. Um, fucking Chuchescu here, uh, is just fucking hot as shit. Oh, also other rule. Um, I'm going to be judging them solely based on the picture that is presented. Not another time, not, uh, not, not a future version of themselves. Whatever Amorous has put in as the picture is what I will go by because some of these motherfuckers get ugly. <laughs> All right. Um, and some of these motherfuckers start ugly. Lennon, I'm looking at you. This is, let's just, they, <laughs> thanks for the follow there. Um, yeah, Chuchescu, solid 10. Lennon, solid one. I mean, this is just like, are you kidding me? Fucking look at these two. This is, this is the two ends of the spectrum. Yeah, that's Lennon, Aspen. That's what Lennon fucking looked like. He was hideous. He was fucking hideous inside and out. The man was just a terrible human being. Um, <laughs> um, here's one that's going to bother a lot. This is going to be visceral for a bunch of you. All right. That's Donald Trump. He was a good looking dude. He's a good looking dude. Back in the day, he had some swag. And you know what? He's not that good looking, but he's decent looking. Right? Like, this is the way I told you. I warned you that was going to kill a bunch of you. I, 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 some of these will 
shift around, but let me get them into positions. Juchescu's not coming down off a 10. He's, I'm sorry, he's a solid 10. This motherfucker may be a, si a, a 7 or something like that, but he's good, he's decent looking. This motherfucker's a solid one. He ain't going anywhere. Um, fucking, all right, so <laughs> it's just... Glennon was dog shit ugly. What are you gonna do? That dude was not a looker. Um, <laughs> you can. I mean, square. Not really. Like the, the whole the whole g g g fucking joke of this is that like I was literally we were talking about dictators and revolutionaries one night and we were going through a whole bunch of them. And I started pulling up photos and I started like like this motherfucker's ugly. Right? Like uh, this no, oh, he's hot. And we're like people started throwing him at me. So this is how this came to be. So I'm I, we're not gonna do the whole uh fucking consensus decision making tonight. We're just gonna do what does Kai fucking think and riff off of that since uh we're doing this. Um Oh, I don't know. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Who who stands? You know what? He's the man of the hour. Putin was always weird looking. He's not fucking. I mean, let's let's admit it, right? Like we'll put them side by side and we'll feel good about it, right? Here we'll get a little justification going. Like, yeah, clearly Putin's better looking than that, but he's still a weird looking motherfucker for sure. Um. He looks blue blooded. You're right. He looks fucking blue blooded. Uh, it, no, 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 no. Libra, a hundred percent of McPoil, a hundred percent of McPoil, dude. We pulled, we compared that. Like he a hundred percent looks like a fucking McPoil. Um, straight up. I I agree. Um, <laughs> yeah, hundred percent. Oh, let's see. All right. Um. Who's popping? Who's popping? Who's popping? All right, you know what? Let's just get it out of the way. I don't think Che is good looking. I've never thought Che is good looking. I, I he's below average for me. Um, fuck it. <laughs> um, the third last guy has a Brendan shout. This. <laughs> No, no, I don't think Che is good looking. I've never thought Che is good looking. Uh, what's up, Wayne? We're doing a completely, uh, if you want, you know, feel free to pull up a chair, have a few drinks. If you, you know, if you like a, a bit of tobacco, enjoy it. Um, so it's, it's, you know, it's the night show. We're rating dictators and revolutionaries. I am at least. We're all rating them. Feel free to speak up, but the tier list is going to be my opinion on this one. Um, fucking, you know what? Uh, all right, let's see. Um, oh, you know what? He was a handsome dude. Milosevic isn't that bad. I, he had swag. There's something about Milosevic. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Che's definitely worse looking than Trump for me. Um, we'll shift him down. Um, Milosevic has, uh, got a, uh, got a fucking, how is Jay next to Putin? Well, he may, he may migrate up, but I gotta tell you, he's never done it for me. He's never done it for me. Um, yeah, he straight up, uh, it's never worked for me. It's, it is what it is, right? Um, we all got our types. We all got our types. <laughs> Viva's okay unfollowed. <laughs> Yeah, I told you this is gonna kill some of you. This is just gonna kill some of you. All right So, you know what? He was a good-looking dude. All right. Does anybody know who I'm who I'm pulling right now? Um Ah, uh, you know what? I don't know. I don't know. Does anybody know who this is? Some fucking <laughs> It's, it's Kim Jong-un. It's Kim Jong-un. It's un. Yeah, Fax got it. Um, And Marcus may or may not have got it. He got Kim. Yeah, it's Kim Jong-un. <laughs> Alice, that dude's higher than Shay. <laughs> Again, he doesn't do it for me and never has. These two might be equal. You know what? I'm going to do that. I'm going to put Shay and Donald Trump equal for me. You know what? Yeah. Yeah, that kind of feels equal. We're going to put Che and Donald Trump on the same line. Um, fucking, yeah, Un looked a lot better as a youngster. 100%. He was a good-looking dude back in the day. 
Um, I mean, you know, I don't look, I got to type in the longtime viewers and regular viewers uh, who've seen all the DGen uh, story time segments know my type. Um, but there's not a whole lot of uh, uh, fucking uh, <laughs> that type on this list, to be perfectly honest. So, you know, I'm, a, I'm an equal opportunity fucker. I, 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 you know, everybody gets a turn at the ride. Um, all right. So. It's the haircut. <laughs> yeah, you know what? It's, it's, it's a pretty modern haircut. Um, although he did go to school in, like, what, Switzerland or some shit? Uh, guy's type is the horse that killed Mr. Hans. Nice, Marcus. Woo! Yeah, when he was still a student in Europe, Viva. Yeah, back in the day. Uh, all right. Let's see. Oh, I don't know. You know what? Oh, this is good. Okay. Oh, um, fucking, yeah, for sure. Um, okay. Young Stalin is a looker and it, it fucking has some swag. All right. Young Stalin is a good looking dude. So yeah, yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm okay with that. Milosevic, I don't know. You know what? Yeah. All right. Milosevic and Un can sort of go kick around six. Young Stalin can go to an eight. Chuchescu can go to ten. Um, you thought he was Arab? Yeah, that's Young Stalin right there. Fucking, he was a looker. Um, equal opportunity fucker. Nicely. <laughs> oh, love it, love it, love it. Um, Stalin gets a five for being mad hairy. <laughs> it's, I get it. I get it. I get it. Um, as long as he was topping me, I wouldn't have an issue with, uh, with it. But if I was going to bottom that dude, which I would, I would, uh, uh, if I, I was going to, if, if he was topping me, I'd be fine with the Harry. But if I was going to top him, which I would, um, I'd fuck this, fuck some sense into that dumb motherfucker. Um, it, we'd have to, we'd have to wax him. We'd, you know, fucking imagine waxing Stalin. That'd be hilarious. Um, <laughs> All right, who's, who's up next? <laughs> I told you it was going to get weird. I told you it was going to get fucking weird. Uh, uh, top gets to shave the bottom. <laughs> oh, oh, me. If I want. Uh, <laughs> is that Saddam? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Saddam's on here, too. Um, it is Saddam. Um, <laughs> waxing poetic up in this, bitch. Um... Yeah, okay. I you know, I don't know how I feel about Saddam. Um No, I'm I'm I I will never not t t fucking Che and Trump get to go on the same line, period. Um <laughs> yeah, Exactly, guys. Uh Harry and Short, no wonder has loved Stalin so much. Uh, also, there's a joke about a 14-year-old in there somewhere. Why is Steven Seagal on the list? I know, right? He so fucking looks it. Batur uh, what is it? What is it? Bat Batursier? Is it Batursier or Bat Bat It's Desi is his first fucking name. It's the motherfucker that went down for like 20 years, right? But yeah, Batursier or some shit like that. Um, yeah, that's, that's the Steven Seagal looking motherfucker right there. Um, Saddam's got Weed Singer and Queen vibes. You know what? He does have some Freddie Mercury vibes. You know what? Just for that, he gets to move up to the six. <laughs> we'll sort some of these out later. Um, Gaddafi? You know what? Gaddafi's popping here. Uh, well, I love, I love Gaddafi's fashion sense, but he's not a good looking man. But you know what? He doesn't have that stupid look that the big poyo looking motherfucker. I just, I can't, I can't stop imagining Putin asking for some milk. Um, yeah, uh, yeah, Tito's up on this bitch. Here, uh, he's right there. This is Tito. Um, yeah, Gaddafi was a rapist. Um, fucking, yeah, I don't, mm, yeah, no. I love his fashion style, especially later in life. Fucking late life, Gaddafi, I love what he was doing. The weird military and the epaulets and the fucking frame of his family pinned onto his church, uh, his chest and shit, and the fucking purple moo moo and shit. Dude, absolutely love it if you're gonna be a crazy fucking dictator be a crazy fucking dictator he had he had the panache he had the panache of a proper dictator 
I, most of these motherfuckers are boring dictators. Few of them got up to some interesting things and they brought their own spin, but a lot of these motherfuckers were boring dictators. And Gaddafi brought Flash. It was always hilarious. Oh, and also go watch his, um, uh, his statement to the UN. Best, best fucking speech to watch ever. Dude, he goes so far over his time. He goes so far over his time and he just refuses to yield the floor and it's just spouting crazy and he's just going off and it just goes on forever. It's Gaddafi's speech to the UN. You want to watch that shit. <coughs> uh, yes. Thank you, Critical. Thank you. <clears throat> 100%, 100%, my man. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> yeah, when Gaddafi wanted France and Jerry to invade Switzerland. He was, Gaddafi was a crazy motherfucker. He was caboose. What's up, Caleb? Ah, uh, Caleb, Caleb. We're, uh, we're getting weird. We're just getting weird up in this bitch. Uh, we're rating, we're rating, uh, dictators and revolutionaries. Um, North, I can't believe Twitch AI recommend this channel to me. Glad to be here. Glad to have you, North. Uh, someday, look, most days we do like headlines and politics and fucking theory and shit like that. But the late shows are going to be this kind of vibe uh, moving forward. So glad to have you as well, my man. Uh, Goldman Sachs fuck Gaddafi. Almost had a murder for the 90% management fees of the Libyan Sovereign Wealth Fund. Yeah, that... I mean, look, Gaddafi was a horrible, horrible man, but he got some shit done. Ain't gonna, like, you can't, like, if you're going to tell the whole story, you got to tell the whole story. Um, and the whole story includes some very impressive improvements to Libya under his regime. So I'm just saying, like, this is an anarchist saying this shit, right? Like, you know, like, dude got shit done. You can't deny that. I don't agree with how he did any of it, but, you know, recognize. Uh, all right, so um, let's do, all right, let's 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 pop some of these motherfuckers. Let's see, Pol Pot, Pol Pot is, he's in an older photo of Pol Pot, and I don't go in for the older dudes. He's He's got fucking Gaddafi vibes. Um, let's get Tito going. Tito's got some crazy, like, um, I don't know, mad scientist vibes. And I'm not sure if he's a four or a five, but you know what? I kind of feel him up here. I'd do him. I'd do him. Um, he's got he's got fucking crazy fucking eyes. I, I it's fucking yeah. Tito, yeah, <laughs> that dude's intense. That was dude is intense. Um, seems like he has a medical kink. Yeah, I feel that. I feel that. What's up, Skillaru? Uh, what's the number where I draw the line for fucking them? I'd fuck them on purpose if I like it, it, the like uh, time travelers thing. I'd fuck a lot of these motherfuckers just to get them back on track. Um, but outside the time travelers thing, um, hmm, you know what? Probably above four, it, between four and five. I'm not, I mean, Che just doesn't do it for me, but you know, he's not bad enough that I'd turn him down. Um,. This crazy motherfucker right here, Tito. Tito, I know would be I'd be in for a good ride. That motherfucker's gonna get out some like whips and shit. He's gonna he's gonna spank me. He proper. He's fucking dude. There's gonna be gloves and shit involved. It's gonna be it's gonna be a good night. It's gonna be a good night. Um, if I get to survive it. Um, fucking you know what? Trump's a looker. You're gonna have to do all the work, and his dick is small. But I mean, you know, when he was younger, maybe you could get a decent performance out of him. Um, I'd probably be disappointed afterwards, of course, but I mean, the fact of the matter is, is that I'd go into it, you know, I'd fucking, I, I don't know if I'd pull the rip, I'd probably pull the rip cord partway through. It's dude, I'd, I'm so, homie, don't play that. Homie, don't play that. Sorry. Uh, no, the Shaw, I don't believe the Shaw is on the list. Hang on. Let's, let's fucking get this. Um... No, no, the Shaw isn't on the list. Uh, <laughs> Trump would drop a deuce midway. <laughs> he would. He would. I agree. Yeah. Um, how was that? All right. Um, is this, is, is this Ebert? Um, this is Ebert, isn't it? 
Oh shit. Um fucking <sighs> The president of the Weimar Republic? Yeah. 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 This is this is the president of the Weimar Republic. Um Oh, that one came in deep. It all comes down to incels with authoritarians, and I know, right? Ah, dude, he's he's. I don't know. He's got something to him. I don't know if he's McPoyle here or up here. I I'm a I'm gonna leave him a tent. You know what? He's kind of. Oh, I'm gonna move those guys down to three and fucking keep him on the same line. Uh, he lacks the mustache for a serious German strongman. I know, I agree, right? Definitely above Putin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, 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 I Apple, <laughs> Tennessee, Appalachia. This motherfucker up in here. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know who this motherfucker is. I don't know who this motherfucker is, but he's got some like African vibe to it or something. Um, mm, mm, I'm taking the picture at the age and the the way they look. Then I, I, he's a two. Yemen, maybe? Do we? Do we? Do, 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 does anybody know who the fuck that dude is? I don't. No, no, that's a sod. This this is a sod right here. Yah, Yah ya Khan. Who the fuck is that, dude? That name does not pop for me. Pakistan. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Pakistan. Um. Yeah. This. This is Assad. I. I know what he looks like as a fucking kid. Um. So, like, I mean, that photo's a bit young, Amorous. <laughs> How old is he in that photo? <laughs> I feel I feel slightly odd here, Amorous. This, this photo looks like a fucking high school photo or some shit. This, this looks like a yearbook photo. He looks like, yes, 100% square. He looks like he's about to go rowing in Massachusetts. Yeah, 100%. He's got, like, John Kerry vibes and shit like that. 14, but already genocided a village in North Syria. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Oh, yeah. Like that dude. I feel a little weird fucking using this photo, Amherst. The youngest one is Kim Jong-un. He's not legal in that photo. Kim's out. Okay. So they're, they're high school. Yeah. All right. Yeah, that fucking feels weird too then. That's like a high school photo of fucking Kim Jong-un. Ooh, I don't feel good about that. Um... Fuck it. Fuck, I, I, I want to take him down to a one on principle. Fucking like, all right. They have to go on one. <laughs> I got to. That shit's got to fucking just nope. Got to nope out of that one real hard. Um, fucking. <laughs> uh, fucking. Uh, you know, if I hey, if I were of, if I were if I went to school with Assad or Kim Jong Un, if they're like you know s fucking probably Swiss private schools, and I were a fellow sc schoolmate of theirs of an appropriate age group, I a hundred percent would do them. Um, but Kai, as an adult, I do not find these individuals attractive because they are underage. Um, fucking. You don't know my boyfriend who goes to a different school. Uh, I can't believe you think Putin is hotter than Kim. Uh, I I don't, but you know what? Where was my cutoff? My cutoff was here. Here. They are attractive, but not in that way. Everything, I already said, everything above a four, I'd fucking give a turn in the sack. So I recognize that there is some level of attra attractiveness there. Um, they are good-looking individuals, but they hold no sexual uh, 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 allure for me. There, we'll go with that. Is that we we all get on board with that one? 
Um, fucking, all right, let's, uh, okay, Idi Amin is just a fucking dummy looking motherfucker. I'm sorry. Fucking, I, you know, no, he's a two. He's a two. Um, <laughs> thank you, Aspen. Um, Marcus, am I covered? Um, <laughs> let me consult counsel. Um, all right, let's do Hirohito's little fucking dummy looking ass. All his fucking military regalia crap. Jesus goddamn Christ. See, on if if Gaddafi wore this shit, I'd be laughing my ass off. On Hirohito, it just seems, I don't know, pretentious. Um, God, threes become quickly becoming a dump stat. Um, all right. Unfortunately, I'm not licensed to practice in horny jail. <laughs> oh, I respect it, Marcus. Um, oh, Cappy doesn't work over here, Caleb. Here. Um, there you go. There's Cappy. Um, all right. Who's the dude in the turban? He's a 10 for sure. That's Khomeini. Yeah, that's, that's Ayatollah. Um, fucking, I don't think he's a 10, but you know what? He's, dude, he's got that. Okay. You know what? I see him as like an equal to Stalin. I could see that. Yeah. You know what? That feels good. That feels good. Those two feel to me, yeah. They feel equal. Um all right, let's get Salazar's fucking trench coat looking wearing ass uh wearing ass motherfucker uh out of here. This is fucking Salazar. I know that creepy looking dude, that dude's got school shooter written all over him. Um fucking Let's see. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> School shooter written all over and puts him in a fuckable category. <laughs> Libra. Just because, just because you clearly are gonna shoot up your high school doesn't mean you're not, you know, you're not an attractive individual. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's got an Adrian Brody kind of feel to him. I, 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 I'm feeling it. Yeah, sure, he's, you know, got school shooter written all over him, but, um, hashtag everyone deserves love. Exactly, Aspen. Exactly, Aspen gets it. Um, I'm gonna leave him at six. He may change. He may change. He may change. Um, <laughs> that, that motherfucker may change. Uh, let's just put it that way. I, I'm feeling he might move up a rank. Uh, let's go. What's uh, Bashir's fucking what? What is it with the air? Um, all right. Let's see. All right. He's he's ah. Uh, you know what? Yeah. He's got he's got three written all over him. Maybe nah. You know what? No, it's just, it's just the whole vibe. It's not working for me. Um, you know, but he's not like whatever's going on down here. Um, thoughts on Castro in two sentences? I mean, ah. <sighs> uh, Douchebag, I wouldn't want running anything, but is a straight stone cold pimp. There you go. I'll give it to you in one. Um. Alright, let's fucking let's get Mao's dumbass out of here. I know what he looks like. Um. Alright, he's better looking than that. He's better looking than that. Uh, he doesn't belong in the high I don't think he belongs in the high school ca category. Is it, I don't you know, he doesn't he doesn't feel like a high schooler in this photo. Um, fucking.
Okay. Okay. There we go. Uh, that's 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 I, I just sort of I, I had to feel it out a bit. I'm, I'm, I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. Um, <laughs> Saddam would argue he needs to be 10. I, you know, fucking I, I respect it. I'd hear him out. I'd hear him out. I think Mao is better. I, you know, all right, look, I got some, I got some needs. I got some, I got some needs and I, I just, I feel like maybe Salazar could fulfill those needs. Um, you know, for the, 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 the viewers know, y'all know if you're, you're a regular, I, I, I have some, I have some desires. I have some wants and needs in my, my sexual life. And I think Salazar probably is rocking those needs. So I'm just saying he belongs there for me. Uh, um, um, fucking not those needs, basically the kink needs. Um, Yeah. Uh, the kink needs. I think Salazar would be there with the fucking chains and the ball gag and the fucking butt plugs and the fucking Salazar would be down. Salazar would be down. He's got that vibe. Yeah, he would. Oh, he'd probably rock those needs. Exactly. Baby. Yeah, Salazar could handle it. Um, one for topping, one for bottoming. No, you know what? You know what? I can, you know, we'll fucking, no, we're good. We're good. I can, I can keep it on the fly. Um, all right. Hang on. All right, let's do this. Um, is this Mubarak? This is Mubarak, isn't it? Huh. That took me a minute. Um. Oh, yeah. I mean, Lenin is goddamn dog shit ugly. That dude was fucking terrible looking. Um. Inside and out. Yeah, that feels right. Yeah, this is a hundred percent objectifying these individuals. Hundred percent ableist objectification going on here, Zero. This you don't get to factor anything other than does this motherfucker make your dick hard? That's what this is about. I so we're on the same page. Um or your girl dick, whatever y'all be rocking. Just speaking for me. Just speaking for me. Um. <laughs> oh God, that's Chavez. This big eared looking motherfucker. That's Chavez. See, I'm having to fucking work off of certain cues. I know certain cues for some of these fucking people. And it's a, a big eared motherfucker. Um, all right. God, no. Yeah, no, you're, dude, three is winning it. All right. Um, oh my God, that's Mussolini. That's Mussolini. Uh, Alice, I'm as gay as they come. That's fucking Mussolini, isn't it? That's fucking Mussolini. Ah. <sighs> God damn it, he's good. He's decent looking. He's not smiling. Yeah, yeah. Like, if he were smiling, he'd be better looking. He's, he's a good looking dude. He's a good looking dude. 
Mussolini's not bad looking. I'd do him. When he had hair. Yeah, exactly. As soon as, as, soon as he le loses hair. He'd be better looking if he smiled more. <laughs> Cheers. Oh. <laughs> That's during the syndicalist days. Yeah, you can tell by the fucking neck wrap. Um, fuck it, yeah. <laughs> fuck it, Libra got to it first. <laughs> um, all right, all right. Um, I think I know who this is. I think this is Robert Mugabe. I think this is Mugabe. Dude, I like black dudes, and he's not doing it for me. Something about... I don't know. He's not working for me. Dude, Mugabe's just not doing it for me. It's also... He was the cannibal, right? Um, this is, Mugabe was the one who was accused of cannibalism, right? Um, yeah, exactly. It's the balls, but no swag. Zero. No, 100%. That's spot on. <laughs> it looks like it was born old. What's up, Smite? Yeah, we're doing hot or not. Dictators and Revolutionaries Edition. Pull up a chair. Get drunk. Get high. Do what you got to do. But we're having fun tonight. It's a night show. Um, no, it was Idi Amin that was the cannibal. That's right, Marcus. Thank you. Thank you. I, fucking, what was Mugabe's deal? Um, fucking. All right. Let's keep going here. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Uh, I already know this 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 motherfucker because the, the Steven Seagal looking motherfucker. That's that Batusia, whatever. It's fucking Desi. His name was Desi. That I know. Guy got sentenced twenty years, I think, to like you know house like fucking confinement in his house or some bullshit. Um, straight up fucking Steven Seagal looking motherfucker that this guy is. Um. See, I need... Okay, so here's the deal. I'm sorry. They have to. They have to go in one. I need a three and a four, and the high schoolers need to get lost. I'm kicking the high schoolers out. That's that's just, just what this boils down to. The high schoolers are gone. The high schoolers are gone. Um, fucking... Yeah. Will Alexander! What is up, my man? Will Alexander, why is Tom from MySpace on the list? Dig. It, Tom from MySpace. <coughs> that's uh, that's a sod. Um, let's see. Oh, Jesus, you got two of them. All right, let's see. I'm a, hello, I am a Brazilian intuitive handmade custom puppet maker. I am interested in collaboration. My puppets can be of anyone. You, Eminem, Frank Sinatra, etc. Do you think your audience would have any interest in these goddamn puppets? Hello, I am a gorgeous man from Jamar. I sell handmade custom glass statues. They can be of anyone. You, Eminem, Frank Sinatra, etc. Especially Frank Sinatra. Get a goddamn glass Frank Sinatra. Just get one. Hello, I'm a magnificent lord from Bolivia. I offer handmade 3d printed nonsense I, it can resemble anyone you eminem frank sinatra etc just get yourself a 3d printed eminem from bolivia it'll be a good investment hello i'm a striking young man from spain i offer finger painted wooden statues they can be of anyone you eminem frank sinatra etc just get a wooden version of yourself you can throw it into a fire scream and act all voodoo it'll be worth the five thousand dollars <laughs> <laughs> oh, Will Alexander, I always love what you write. You know I do. Um. <laughs> oh, and thank you again for the biddies. Uh, should we have a victims of imperialism tier list? Oh, I mean, that'd be interesting. <laughs> Dick, yeah, probably, right? Um, okay. Um... I don't. Hmm. I don't know. Oh 
God. I feel like I know you. I don't know you. I... Mm, I don't know. I, I feel like I know you. I... I, I mm, don't think I know you. Um, I'm not... I'm not a percent, hundred percent on him. Um, and oh god. Okay, so I feel like I know these two, but you know I'm not brilliant at with. I'm I'm not getting the cues. That's Franco. That's motherfucking Franco. Is there a garb? Uh, anyway. Fucking. Um. Oh God. This is Nasser? Okay. You know what? He's doable. I can work off of that one. So that's Nasser. Uh, you know what? It's better looking than you. Yeah. It's better looking than. Uh, What's up, Mythic? Um, anyway. Uh, we're doing uh, Hot or Not, Dictators and Revolutionaries Edition. Pull up a chair, get drunk, get high, do what you gotta do. Um, again, Dictators and Revolutionaries Edition. Um, oh god, that that means these two I should know. Motherfucker, I know you. I know you. Who am I forgetting? Dictators. <laughs> There's a helicopter joke in there. There's a helicopter joke in there. All right. Fucking Pinochet. Um. No, you still belong there. Yeah, that all feels right. All right. Um. Yep, I don't know these last three. I'm just going to rank them. I don't know these last three. I'm just going to rank them. Um, just how it's going to uh, gonna go down here. All right, you're a good-looking dude. Um... Oh, he's got swag. He's got good cheekbones, solid chin, good lips. I, you know what? He's got swag. You, oh, you feel. Maybe, maybe, maybe. All right. You, my friend. You, my friend, are the last one remaining. All right. You don't like Chichescu? Zero. Dude, Chutescu does get for me. Sorry. Um. Yep. Cool. 
All right, this is the final tier list. Hold on, let's uh, let's go over here really quickly. Let me uh, pull a few things, move a few things, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, and so forth. Um, and then we will pull this over. Cool. All right, let's go back to it now. All right, here is the final tier list. Fucking. <sighs> Dictators and Revolutionaries Edition, as rated by me, an anarchist. Um, we have our final list. All right. Feel free to disagree. I if 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 everybody agreed with me, my ratings of these people, I would be concerned for humanity. Um. So yeah, that that's dude that that's that would be no good for our, our for our species if everybody. Mm. Yeah, caboose, I did. So fucking, let's just go down the list, shall we? Um, fucking Chuchescu rocks it for me. <coughs> fucking, he just does. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna pop the fucking file. Hold on, give me a second here. All right. I have it here. There we go. Um, because Amaris provided me ever so kindly with a zip file of all of their thumbnails with their names. Um, so I could then go through it. So let me try and play match the dictator game here. Just to make sure. Okay. So I know this is, uh, this is, uh, uh oh, fucking... There we go. Let's do that. Um, I know this is Chuchescu, but uh, let's fuck uh, Nikolai, uh, Nikolai Chuchescu. Yes. Okay. 100%. Um, all right. Who is our dapper looking young? Chun Du Huan. Chun Du Huan. Um, South Korean politician, dictator, and army general. Interesting. Yeah. Did not even know that one. Um, <laughs> uh, you can f uh, fuck while he's still in his prime, but make sure you don't get hitched. All right, what you got? Ah, God, no. Um, all right. So anyway, um, fucking, we got Mussol, uh, uh, fucking, um, not, not Mussolini. We got Stalin here. Um, so we got South Korea and, uh, we got fucking Stalin going on here. Um, hey, <laughs> you, Eminem, Frank Sinatra, etc. Just follow the channel. Thank you kindly for the follow. Whichever of you mother crazy motherfuckers just spun that account up. Um, <laughs> absolutely love it. Absolutely love it. Uh, whoever did it got a good on you. Um, all right. So, uh, all right. Let me just make sure here. I'm trying, like, trying to fucking find them and compare them and make sure um uh can i hold on there we go yeah that's better that's better i like that formatting better and can i oh i can i can blow those up even further cool good deal um all right so Nasser, and then we got fucking oh you know what this ain't working for me <laughs> sorry fiddly behind the scenes uh i need i need a fourth monitor i need a fourth monitor that's that's what it boils down to at the end of the day i need a fourth monitor <laughs> first world needs um okay so we got uh nasser we got kamani um we got this dapper gentleman here park chung he Park Chung He. What I'm learning is that I need to. Uh, he was the South Korean dictator as well. Okay, interesting. Uh, yeah, I need to study up on my South, uh, like my e in like East Asian dictators. Apparently, um, that's what I'm fucking learning here. Uh, we got Tito's fucking uh, crazy ass. I know that's. I'm sorry, not Tito. Uh, fucking um, Salazar, not Tito. Fucking Salazar. Um. 
Salazar's fucking school shooter looking ass. Um, <laughs> 100% looks like a school shooter. I'm just saying. Um, <laughs> uh, then let's see. We got Mao, right? Mao. Yes, that's Mao. Um, and then we got Stalin. Yep, that's Stalin. Okay, so got um, fucking. <laughs> so we got Salazar, Mao, and fucking uh, uh, Stalin all lined up on sevens. And keep in mind, I would do all these motherfuckers. Uh, some of these people, I would really fuck their brains out and just do a number on their head just to, you know, maybe make sure that millions of people don't die. Mao, looking at you. Um, fucking <laughs> also, you know, Stalin, Mussolini, you know, fucking, <laughs> these guys got body counts. Dude, these motherfuckers got body counts. Um, this is a list with some serious bodies on it for sure. Uh, there's no way around that. Uh, we got Saddam Hussein here. Hey, you know, he's, he's still got a little baby fat. What are you going to do? Um, fucking. Um, what, what, what do you, you know, what, what, what do you, hey, just, you know, he needs to uh, cut, get cut a little bit more, my brand. Um, he never really did though, did he? Um, so, Jesus Christ, this is the stupidest fucking thing. Oh God. We got Mubarak there on the right. Um, and then, oh God, which one of you idiots was that? That was, um, Milosevic. That's Milosevic. There is a fucking kid. Um, then we got, uh, what the, the ever so controversial, the, the ever so controversial row, uh, uh, uh fucking row five, um, Donald Trump, Che Guevara and Tito's crazy looking fucking medical fetish have an ass. These all are on five for me. Yes, Che Guevara and Donald Trump are equally attractive to me as aesthetically. Sorry, kids. I hate to, I, you know, I know many of you are just disappointed with me. I understand. I understand. Um, <laughs> Jay can go fuck himself. Uh, <laughs> Oh, so I'd have a threesome with Che and Trump. Okay, Che could probably bring the heat that Trump is lacking. So, you know, you could have a good time with it for sure. You could have a good time with it at least. Yeah, because fucking Trump's going to be a disappointment in the bedroom. But around somebody like fucking Che, he's going to try and live up to the expectation, right? He's going to perform like he's going to be like, you know, macho man. Like, oh, I, I, I can keep up. I can keep up. Right. And Che's going to fucking lay some pipe. So fucking yeah, Che 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 could elevate Trump's game in the bedroom for sure. So yeah, you know why not threesome with them? It would work. Um, fucking. <laughs> God, I'm thinking I'm high. Fucking nausea reduction. We got fucking Mr. Helicopter Pinochet himself, and then we got crazy ass fucking Emperor of Japan Hirohito. Um. You know, for me, they're kind of just the same dude aesthetically. I, I you know, they're, they're just, it's, that's the same vibe. I just get the exact same vibe off of both those dudes. Um, fucking, I 100% want to see Gaddafi in Hirohito's outfit. I 100% want to see Gaddafi in Hirohito's outfit. Dude, H Gaddafi would rock the shit out of that. Hirohito looks like a fucking accountant. He looks like a fucking accountant, all right? He does not belong in that outfit. Fucking Gaddafi could rock that outfit. Gaddafi would make that outfit look tame and calm. Gaddafi would be like, yeah, no, this is just like, you know, my pajamas. This is what I wear to bed. This is casual wear on a Sunday for me. Um, <laughs> Again, I didn't make the fucking list, so I'm sorry. Um, they're not on the list. And so your feelings about these particular politicians aside, I didn't create the fucking list. If you want to make a list for me to rank aesthetically attractive, you know, uh, ableistic reductionist fashion, a group of politicians to include Clinton, Bush, Obama, feel free to put in the work and create that list. And I will do that one of these night shows. 
th- uh, Tuesdays and Thursdays for the night shows. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, uh, 5.30 p.m. Pacific, for those that are new. Um, so we got Gaddafi's crazy ass. Look, I don't find him hot, um, but, like, you know, he's not, he's not Lenin, right? Like, he's not Lenin. Like, this is a dude, like, maybe in his prime. Maybe in a prime. Let's make it a series. Hey, I'm down. I'm fucking down. Um, so, um, yeah. Like, I, I, you know, Pol Pot, I don't know. He's just, he's a little too old for me in this photo. It's not doing it. It's the, the hat. I don't, I don't know. It's, it's just, I, Pol Pot's not doing it for me. What, what can I fucking say? Um, <laughs> homie ain't working it. Um, fucking Bashir here. Um, Bashir here. And then we got Chavez over here with his, I, I don't know. Look, Bashir's just too old. He's out of my age range. I don't like the fucking mustache. I don't like the fucking glasses. The stupid hat doesn't do it for me either. Thanks for the fall, love God. Um, and so, you know, I'm not down. Um, Chavez is goofy fucking ears and his stupid looking uniform. Oh, fucking Karina. What are you doing? Last one ever. All right, fine. Uh, thank you, Karina, though. Uh, <laughs> break you guys of this habit. Um, fucking Mugabe. I don't look. Uh, something about Mugabe. You know what? I you know I'm, I'm I'm starting to feel the vibe. Mugabe has like a um, sort of like a a, a fucking vaudevillian era cross-dressing lesbian vibe like a mom's mabley mugabe's giving me a mom's mabley vibe in that um for those that know your fucking references look there's 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 some youngins in here who especially don't know who the fuck mom's mabley is but if you know who mom's mabley is mugabe's giving me mom's mabley vibes um so there you go run with that um, fucking, this is that Batusier guy. I just fucking Steven Seagal. He, he looks like Steven Seagal. Batusier looked like Desi. Uh, he looked like fucking Steven Seagal. Um, straight up. <laughs> there's, there's, there's no way around that. That dude has like straight Steven Seagal vibes and there's no way you find that attractive. <laughs> That's just, that ain't going to be doing it for anybody. Let's just be honest with ourselves for a second. Uh, God, oh Lord, what are we doing with our lives? Um, fucking okay, Weimar Republic, uh, dude here. Fucking yeah. Oh God, damn, I keep doing that. Um, Ebert or Siskel. I had to make the joke eventually. Um. Oh, okay. Cool. All right then. Uh, good to know, Karina. Um. <laughs> oh, gee, yeah. Because uh, for those of you that do want to sub, just know that you, there's a sub command that you can use. That, um, fucking that, or, or donation, or donos, or tip. Don't don't sub on Twitch. Don't sub on Twitch. Don't give Amazon your money. There's so many better ways to do it. We use coffee here. Um creators get paid more they get the money immediately and and jeff bezos doesn't get a fucking cut right now dude we're just taking up electricity for these motherfuckers let's just get it get twitch to pay some of the bills right who cares uh if you're doing prime subs though you know that's free money i get it um so anyway uh fucking khrushchev i mean this is khrushchev yeah this is khrushchev um he's just i mean I don't know. I what it, what a he's an average dude in a business suit. He's just he's boring. He's boring. <sighs> All right, let's get to McPoyle here. Look, he's not Lenin ugly, but McPoyle looking motherfucker that this doofy motherfucker looks like. Putin's not a good looking dude. He's never been a good looking dude. It's why he overcompensates so much. He's just not. He's just. <laughs> it, it, look, Libra, if I could put Lenin further in the can, he would be. Dude, Lenin is not a good looking human being. 
inside and out, as I keep pointing out. Not a good dude. Um, but, he, you know, McPoyle up here looks a little bit better than him. Uh, you know, yeah, that's that's not the same fucking thing, for sure. Um, this was that con dude. Um, I, you know, what are you going to say? Look, I... You gotta be a certain type of, uh, of individual to pull off a military uniform. You gotta have some swag to it, right? You gotta have some panache. You gotta have some character in your soul to really pull off a military uniform, especially if you're the kind of dude that rises to dictatorship level. So, you know, he's not doing it. He's not doing it. What can I, you know, it is what it is. Um, fucking, this is Idi Amin, right? This is the crazy motherfucker that was eating people. All right. So, I mean, you know, you could see Putin eating somebody. This is the right vibe, right? Like, this is the same level. This crazy motherfucker be eating people. And again, he's a boring dude in a business suit that went, eventually went batshit crazy. But, like, you know, he's a boring dude in a business suit who ended up eating some motherfuckers. So, you know, let's just kick him out of the club. Um, fuck it. Uh. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go with a no on that one. And the Vosh hate is insane. I absolutely love it. Dude, it's fucking delicious. Dude. People hate Vosh. It's fucking, dude, don't care that much. Don't care that much. Vosh is a rhetorician and an orator and a streamer. That's it. Just leave it at that. Like, and he's a good rhetorician, by the way. Sorry, he is. Um, you may disagree with his points, but as far as his skillful use of rhetoric goes, he knows what he's doing. I will never take that away from him. His positions, his profile, his character, his essence as a human being, all of this up is up for fucking conversation as far as I'm concerned. But as far as his skill as a rhetorician goes, the dude's got, he's got game. Just give him that. Uh, he's a halfway decent orator. Um, but dude, it, people hate on Vosh so hard. It's hilarious. Like, dude, who gives a shit? He gives a shit. You know, there's like real evil in this world, right? Like people who are like doing harm. We got a video on the server right now, verified by German uh, German fucking media, that a uh, um a, a overhead um surveillance platform literally zooms in, and you can fucking see up close a Russian soldier just summarily executing a father in front of his wife and kid. And it's been verified by German media. They tracked down the guy, the, the pilot of the drone and everything. And it's like, you know, Vosh is not putting a gun to like some father's, some kneeling, crying father's head in the middle of Ukraine right now, executing him. So like, take it down a fucking notch and get some perspective on your life. People need to fucking chill. To it. This is why fucking people the left eats itself all the time. It's because crazy shit like that. Fucking who gives a fuck? Take it down. All right. So Lenin, right? I mean, look, I, I have a personal grudge against Lenin. This is the motherfucker that betra betrayed Nestor. This is the motherfucker that bombed the like artillery shell to the anarchist club in Moscow. This is a motherfucker that let like straight up did some green light on anarchists, right? I got problems with Lenin, but he's also dog shit hideous, right? This motherfucker is ugly. Like, this is, this is the definition of ugly here, folks. Like, he's not a good-looking dude. Um, so, fuck him. Like, for a lot of reasons. Um, yeah, and fuck Stalin. And fuck anybody who likes Stalin. Stal Stalin was an authoritarian prick who, you know, got what he deserved, but not soon enough. Let's just put it that way. That motherfucker, fuck Stalin. But Stalin would have purged Vosh. Yeah, that's why Stalin is a horrible, horrible human being and should never be looked up to. Anyway, so. Oh, no, no, no. He's got like Asiatic descent and shit, Karina. Um, if Tim Pool and Lennon had a baby, it would look like Tim Pool's a square. 
I got the fucking sound effect. Why am I fucking doing that for you? There you go. Yeah, I actually have the cue. Um, is is Hazzy two holes a go Oh shit, are we doing it? Here, let's do it. Um, that's our pocket has. Is this stream based or cringe? That's for you to decide. Because here's the truth of the matter. Uh, I'm an anarchist. Hi, my name's Kai. Uh, I believe in individual autonomy. So, uh, Yagi, it's up to you to decide for yourself whether this stream is based or cringe. Or none of the above. Um, or some combination therein. Tonight, either way, we're just wrapping up. a. a, a we did we did a hot or not dictators and revolutionaries edition. It's the night show. We're getting a little weird. I'm tired. I'm kind of high. Um, and feel free to join me. Um, so we're just wrapping that up. Either way, uh, we were just talking about the dog shit ugly that uh, face that is uh, fucking Lenin here. Um, and then we've got the like honorable mentions here. They have to go in category in like the lowest level because they're fucking high schoolers. This is Kim Jong Un, and this is Assad, right? This is Un. Here's Assad over here. And they're both decent looking dudes. Um, they, they have aesthetic appeal to them, but they're fucking high schoolers. So they're level one. Uh, Cause I agreed at the beginning of this, uh, the outset of this little project here that I would be judging them solely on their picture, not who they will become or who they were. Um, and so that's just how that ended up. <laughs> so, um, and then we got Franco's punk ass. Um, God, I keep fucking doing that. Uh, we got Franco's punk ass. Um, so, you know, multiple problems here with him, especially as an anarchist, but also he's just not doing it for me. He's too old. He's too balding. He's too, his mustache is stupid. The wrong, he's got the wrong size shaped head. I don't dig his chin. I don't like, dude, I don't like him. He's fucking ugly to me. So there you go. There's, there's the fucking list. <laughs>